Good morning and thank you for joining us here on ClickDHouston.com. Plenty of heat for today, no surprise there. 88 degrees at 10 a.m., 92 at lunchtime this afternoon in the mid 90s. But of course, those feel like temps this afternoon will range between 103 and 105 degrees. We could see a slight shower early this morning. A stray coastal shower is possible here in Houston. The best chance will be in the afternoon, but our rain chances for today only at 10 percent. We have a huge ridge of high pressure that's dominating our weather pattern. It's backing off to the southwest that will build back into North Texas and the Plain States next week. And what happens around this ridge of high pressure is you have all the storms popping up. We call it the ring of fire. So there is a chance that we'll see a stray shower just because we tend to be on the edge of this ridge of high pressure. Hopefully as we get into next week, those rain chances will go up, but they're looking pretty slim for now. Our future cast model showing you that stray shower in the morning possible along the coast. And then this afternoon, about a 10% chance of an isolated shower. I do think this future cast model overdoing our chances is big time. We still have a lot of dry, dusty air in place, and that is going to hold back our rain chances. But a stray shower is possible, so just keep your eye to the sky. Uh, once we get past about 7:30 at night, we'll turn off that chance. And then during the day on Thursday, yet again, mainly in the afternoon, a good chance of seeing a pop-up shower. And we'll keep that chance in forecast through Friday and also the weekend. We're still tracking tropical storm Darby. The winds this morning have increased 65 miles per hour. No threat to land, but there is a chance that it will continue to strengthen. And reach hurricane status. Then we are tracking Hurricane Celia, which continues to fall apart. The winds are down to 75 miles per hour, so just barely a Category 1 hurricane. Again, both of these systems are no threat to land. Meanwhile, the Atlantic continues to be fairly quiet. We have a little bit of convection over the Yucatan. That's pretty much it, but nothing that you need to worry about in terms of tropical development in the Atlantic Basin. We will be in the mid 90s all the way through the weekend. We are expecting a little more Saharan dust on Thursday and Friday, so if you do have asthma or allergies, please be warned that those symptoms might be heightened to close out the work week. Then for Saturday and Sunday, we do have Dash playing on Saturday, so head on out and cheer on the ladies. We'll have a 20% chance of an afternoon shower. We'll keep that in for next week as well, and Dynamo will be home on next Wednesday.